and today I've decided that everything that I eat and drink today is going to be green. Lots of green vegetables and some fruits and I'm trying to stick with whole foods because they're really healthy and green vegetables have tons of nutrients, vitamins, uh, antioxidants and protein even and this drink that I'm having is a fresh juice which has parsley and kale and celery, watercress, dandelion greens, um, apple and I also had them put a little ginger in there to pump up the, um, the taste and it's also really um, good and has some nutritional benefits as well. So anyway, so cheers and continuing on with my green day, I'm going to eat some pistachios and they're actually really healthy for you and they have a lot of protein in them, they have calcium actually and they have iron as well and also a lot of dietary fiber which is good to keep you regular and um, a lot of people don't realize that a lot of seeds and nuts and beans and um, and greens and just a whole plant-based diet like you do get a lot of protein and calcium and things that you wouldn't normally think that you could get them in so um, so anyway so and you know the only way you wouldn't get enough of your nutrients is if you didn't eat enough fruit uh, enough food to satisfy your energy needs so as long as you're doing that and you're eating like a whole foods plant-based diet staying away from some of the vegan junk food as well because there's vegan junk food these days so anyway so here we go with the pistachios you can see they're very green and um, they're fun to eat so now I'm having a green smoothie and what this is is I have some frozen strawberries, frozen bananas, some rice milk, a little water, and a little bit of stevia for a sweetener and also spirulina which is what's making it green and also adding a lot of nutritional benefits as well. And it's really good. <laughs> And I'm continuing my day of eating and drinking only green things. And what I have here is a beautiful salad, which is arugula, chives, and spinach. And these are mung beans, which I actually soaked overnight. So they're not cooked um, and they're not sprouted, but they're just soaked. So they're sort of crunchy and delicious. And, uh, and I also have some guacamole. So uh, bon appetit. So I just made some green hummus, um, which all I did was took a regular hummus recipe and uh, added parsley to it. And it tastes really good and now it's green so it goes with the theme of the day to only eat green food. So and then of course I'm going to have it on green apple slices. So it's really delicious and you should try it. Your hummus doesn't even have to be green, it's still really good on apples.